All right, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Keenan. Welcome to today's third blog. The Outback Bowl will be played against South Carolina, top um, 10 team in the nation, against number 18, Michigan. Now, both these two teams came short of making it to their conference championships, respectively, but I think this is going to be a good consolation prize of a game for both these two teams, and I think this is going to be a competitive one. Start with South Carolina, they're head by quarterback Connor Shaw. He needs to step it up just a little bit. He's been getting too many comparisons to uh, Garcia from a couple of years ago, but I think Connor Shaw is a better overall quarterback, particularly better at a, as a passer. He just needs to prove that to everybody. Now, we all know about running back Marcus Lattimore. He has been dealing with a series of injuries throughout his career, but he's still leading the team overall 4.6 yards per carry and over 600 yards. If he just stays healthy, this guy is a true Heisman candidate, and he will be a great prospect for the 2014 NFL Draft. I think he should stay after this season. He's actually rated in the top 10 on running backs for the 2013 NFL Draft, but I don't think he's too ready just yet. Now, on the defensive side, they have, they're one of the top defenses in the nation, led by his true sophomore, Jadavion Clowney, who leads the SEC with 13 sacks, SEC Player of the Year. He's a great player. And I think he's, he's going to have a good game against this Michigan Wolverines. Now, going to Michigan, I think they have a good team under second-year coach Brandy, Brady Hope. He's a, he has, he's a good head coach, led his team to a Sugar Bowl victory over um, Virginia Tech last season. But this year, they're playing against an SEC opponent, and this is going to be a tough one at that. Now, they're going to have to put the ball in the hands of Denar Robinson a lot in this matchup. He's actually going to be prospected as a wide receiver for the 2013 NFL Draft. Not too much like a quarterback. He reminds me a lot of Antoine Randall L. during his time at Indiana. And I think Denard Robinson can still make that transition to be a wide receiver in the National Football League and even come up with a couple of trick plays, particularly for him to throw the football a couple of wide receiver passing plays for Denard Robinson. But we have to see, based on his performance, he might even be able to be a good return specialist for any team in the National Football League. Now, one of the top prospects for um, Michigan that I'm definitely going to be looking at is offensive tackle Taylor Lewain. He's actually one of my top five um, offensive tackle prospects for the 2013 NFL Draft. I think he could be due for a good game. He needs to have a, a good workout, and I think he's going to be a good first-rounder for any team in the National Football League. Now, defensively for Michigan, they average allowing 18.6 points per game. They don't really have any true studs in the defensive side, but they did work well as a unit overall with, with Brady Hoke's team. I do like that defense. I think they're going to keep up with South Carolina, but I think South Carolina's speed is going to be just a tad bit too much for Michigan, so I'm going to have to go with South Carolina over the Wolverines in this matchup. Now, I'm going to catch you guys in just a second to give you guys the preview of Another bowl matchup, another Big Ten SEC showdown between Nebraska and Georgia. I'm just catching you in just a second. Thank you for watching this blog. I'm your man, Akeem McCall. Be easy.